I just couldn't believe it. I was flabbergasted. I, 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 Eyewitnesses almost at a loss for words after gunshots ring out on a busy University City street. Tonight, two suspects are on the run after trying to rob an armored truck. Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. And I'm Natasha Brown. And for Jessica Cartelia today, amazingly, no one was hurt after the bullet started flying. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lance has been following this story all day. She is live in University City now with more on this investigation. Shante. Yeah, Natasha and Yuki, Philadelphia PD and the FBI are investigating down the street here. This is 36th Street near Market Street outside of the PNC Bank. Police believe the suspects knew the time that the ATM would be filled, but unfortunately for them, those security guards took quick action. I heard about six to seven shots ring out. Complete chaos on the 3500 block of Market Street in University City during a brazen attempted robbery. I've never experienced anything like this with the shooting so close to where I work, so I'm a little scary. Philadelphia police say just before 10 a.m., two masked gunmen tried to rob two security guards from a Garda armored truck. They were trying to make a cash drop at a PNC Bank's ATM. At that point, as he dropped the bag in order to turn it over to them, his partner, did turn and discharge his firearm in their direction. Police say both guards shot at the two suspects. It's not clear if the suspects returned fire, but police say one ran away, the other hopped into a SUV that sped off. Many living and working in the area heard multiple gunshots and ducked for cover. When you heard the first two, it was like, are those firecrackers? And then when you heard more, it was like, no, like get down, protect yourself. Police say the suspects dropped both bags of money, a gun and ammunition. Eyewitness news cameras were rolling just a few blocks away on the 3600 block of Pearl Street when police discovered a maroon Chevy Trailblazer with bullet holes and a smashed window. Investigators are trying to determine if the SUV was the getaway vehicle. With the high volume of people normally on Market Street, police say they're surprised no one was hurt. We know there were people running from the scene or people driving by the scene, so we are extremely lucky that no one was injured innocently or anyone was struck with gunfire. And police say there's a lot of surveillance video from both Penn and Drexel universities, as well as private cameras. They're hoping that that video could help lead to some arrests. Reporting live in University City, Shante Lands, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Shante, thank you.